Logan Kane here, and this is Paper Sorcerer, episode 34. This time around, I, d I rested up after the Catacombs run last time, and I also added level 2 energy skills to every oh, well, all four of my main guys. So hopefully I, have I should have one or two more energy for each of each of my main. Each of my mains. Anyway. A dark-haired man with a stern look on his face stands in your path. Raising his weapon, he speaks. I... I don't know. What is that guy gonna sound... He's gonna sound like a midget. I don't know how to sound like a midget. I am here to stop you. Using whatever means. I must. Is there a way I can convince you to cease these efforts? Is there a way I can convince you to cease these efforts? Good job, guys. Good, good job, QA team. Get out of the way, fool. No, I'm, I'm kind of a polite guy. I apologize, but I must pass. I understand, but can we find a non-violent way to resolve this? Ready your weapon. If you won't leave, then I'm afraid we're at an impasse. Regrettably, I believe that's impossible. I'll go with the impasse. If I must. On your guard! <laughs> oh, right, fight. This guy looks a little... Look at his shoes and that little claw that... Anyway. I suppose we should open up with an arterial... No, no, no. Bloodbath. You know, I would... You know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know. <laughs> Just gotta make fun of myself sometimes. Anyway, I wish Arterial Slice would instead... Actually, I'll do this. I wish Arterial Slice would instead be the bleeding skill. Because that makes sense. You cut their artery, they start bleeding. Ooh, it's Yarwin the Priest. That's why he looks all weird. He's a priest. And he's bleeding. Bloodbath? Bloodbath sounds like I'm going and attacking a bunch of people. Arterial Slice sounds like it would be a... Bleeding. It just seems, seems like it would be a bleeding attack to me. And there's some divine blessing for himself. 37 strength up. You know what? I think I'm going to use both my sorcerer and my cultist's abilities. This time around. Do a poison fist, of course. Eh... We'll keep it simple. Some brutal strike. Wow, look at that. Six nine 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 seven nine five nine. Everybody that nine energy, it's great. I didn't realize how amazing that would be. Yes, circle of power. And then the cultist is going to do his divine power. And hopefully that gives us lots and lots and lots of extra damage. And from the looks of things, this guy's going to go down quick. He's got three damage over times on him already. Oh my god, did you see that damage? 208. And now we're going to buff strength even more. And even more. Look at this. Hold level... Oh no! Don't paralyze my Minotaur. He's the one that I like. Anyway. I've been saying anyway, and you know, way too often... I need to stop it. It's awful. It sounds stupid. Alright, Scorch. Let's try and get yet another dot on him. And the cultist, uh, where's your... What is it? Mobile? Mobilize? Mending! Yes. Make the Minotaur able to attack. See what... Charging Fist should even do a lot... Yeah, that, that's pretty good for a Charging Fist. Fish? Fist! Doing pretty well, considering all the buffs that <laughs> all my guys have. Divine Fury. That sounds like an AoE hit. No, just a really hard hit on my sorcerer. But really, insubstantial. Should we use this? No. Let's just break him. Break! And then Minotaur. Can you still do stuff? Nah, I'd rather wait for the Brutal Strike. I wish the Minotaur had more skills to use. But oh well. They'll be okay. What about Soul Steel? That sounds like a good idea. Soul Steel and then the Cultist. Heal up that sorcerer real quick. Nah, do regular heal. You have plenty of energy. Heal up the sorcerer, and let's see what happens. He took 85 damage from dots there. 238. 200. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think he was going to last too long. I think I've become too strong for these guys. The bosses have become incredibly easy for me. Alright. Uh, just some level ups of skills. Some level up of skill. Nothing new. Nothing new. Nothing new. And... The puppet. Hey, here's something. You've gained a new skill. Unsealing rune. Remove the seal effect from an ally. Level 1. I don't even know what that is. Although seal... 
If it's like any other game, sealed just means I can't cast magic. Alright, what do we got here? I guess someone else will have to do the praying this time. He staggers, then falls to the ground. Well, the priest wasn't very hard, but maybe... What? 22 to 180 plus extra defense damage. Sundering Axe. Let's take a look at that. What does my Minotaur have right now? 45 to 138. Huh. So my minimum damage will go 20 points down, but that defense, that extra defense and the chance to hit harder? Man. Not going to be able to pass that up. Well, I guess that's it for episode 34. I'm going to mutter around and shudder and shumble and appear somewhere else. Rumble, la 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 la, just as the tremors. The sixth binding has been broken. We're getting closer. I can't get a good reading on block eight. There must be something blocking my powers. My agents have told me there are a lot of bears, though, so I guess watch out for bears. <laughs> the overseer of... Block 8 is Akamai the Mage. You may remember him from when you were sealed up in here. Her powerful magic... Wow. Her magic is powerful, so be very careful. Ah, I wanted to read that. I like reading the zombie one. I accidentally right-clicked. Oh well. Let's have a talk. Let's have a talk, Chaos Wizard. I heard there's someone sealed away on Block 8 that's so strong they had to use some pretty extreme security methods. He's got to be a really nasty fellow. I try to avoid block eight. It smells like animals live there or something. Hey, I got a real hot tip. Ha ah, fooled you. I never leave town. I have no idea what's going on out there. I think there's another one. Oh, no, it's just back. What? Did it say trusty or tricksty? Tricksty. Trixie. Trixie Goblin. Trixie! Anyway, that is it for Paper Sorcerer episode 34. If you like this episode, do the... Well, actually, I really don't care about likes. I don't even know what they do on YouTube. But subscriptions would be nice. Then again, if you guys are watching, who cares? All right. Uh, enjoy.